Came to see if you wanted to plan a two-on-two this weekend at Venice Beach. We can hustle a few games together to get the money for the entry fee, all right? You're joking, right? Dude, there's a million leagues I can play in right now. Tons of opportunities to get scouted. I'm straight. You seriously still trying to play pro ball? I mean, maybe not the G League, but... Wow. What? What? You don't think I'm good enough? Right, you just make so much more sense now. Yeah? You don't make any sense. <laughs> Hit him with that wow. You know what yeah, that means. Wow. <laughs> Welcome back to GMAP. That was a clip from White Men Can't Jump. The comedy follows basketball hustlers Kamal and Jeremy as they team up to win $500,000 playing in a tournament. And joining us now to tell us all about it is one of the stars of the movie, Senqua Walls. <laughs> See you first. It's been 30 years since the original. No, it's a crazy, crazy, crazy. Thing. And I ask you, were you born at the time? <laughs> I, it's like was, I watched it with my dad. Yeah, I was born at the time. Like I said, I watched it with my dad, um, and I, I'm pretty sure I watched it on HBO. I don't think it was in the theaters. When <laughs> <laughs> I, it wasn't in the theaters when I watched it. <laughs> All right, so real quick, you're playing, uh, of course, Kamal. Yes. Uh, it's the iconic role that was played by Wesley Snipes. Yes. What do you think about the film? What do I think about the original? What do yeah, I think about well, no, what you're doing ours. now. Oh, my gosh. Down. I think, you know, it was really important to us when we went and filmed every day to make sure that we honored what they did for us, right? Like, they set a great foundation. That's why I still call White Man Can't Jump. But they, they set a great foundation for us. And then to retell it and, and adapt it for today's audience was just a great deal of responsibility. And how close is it to the original, since we're going to talk about the first one as well? I think there's what, what audience will come to see is that there's great callbacks to the original. We're a totally different adapted story. Um, there's a totally different element of mental health that's infused into this one. Uh, but we have really great callbacks, both cinematically and also like from the dialogue perspective of what the original had to offer. And you were perfectly cast oh, thank you. for this role because basketball is your thing. You yeah. played in college. Yeah. yeah, I did. And you played in the NBA All-Star Game. Yeah. I so, I mean, is that like... <laughs> <laughs> Listen, <laughs> take a rest. <laughs> So, I mean... I have 16 points, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, there he is. You can flex on that a yeah, little bit. Yeah, I, had, six, I had a quiet 16 in that game. So, was it, what was it like to, I mean, was that like just a dream role for you? That, the role was a dream role for me, and the opportunity to play in the All-Star game as well was a dream for me come true. I think, you know, growing up a basketball player who didn't make it to the NBA, you know, the, and you have delusions of one day wanting to play in the All-Star game, and then you actually get to do it. Um, from a perspective of being an actor, it was like all my loves coming together. So it was a gift. And then because of me playing in a basketball movie that I grew up loving, um, it was special. So you can obviously play basketball, but Jack Harlow, I mean, right. we know him for music. Correct. Can he actually play basketball? You know, the movie is called White Man Can't Jump. <laughs> for a reason. For a reason. <laughs> reason. But I can honestly say that that white man can't jump. So he can play. He can, he can dunk. He can actually dunk. He did a lot of his own dunking stunts. Um, he did a great job. He did a great job. He can shoot a little bit. Um, and he's very competitive. It was just Mother's Day. You have said that your mother was such a huge part of Shout who out to you Cassandra. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Mama's yeah, boy. Yeah. Mama's big. Yeah, we love Cassandra. a mama's boy around here. Um, <laughs> well, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, you know what's funny is, is, is my mom would be the first to actually say he's not a mama's boy because she was tough. She was. Uh, my, the love of my life, but she did not pull any punches in the best way possible. But I'll, yeah, tell me, where are we going? Where... No, no, just has that shaped who you are, <laughs> like, I guess. Yeah, she um, was the greatest lesson that I ever had in life. Wow. Um, she has some things I can't say on camera. <laughs> <laughs> Her greatest lessons, you know, I think anybody that, that grew up with a really passionate mother, and my mom was a single mom, um, her lessons sometimes came with a little bit of cinnamon. Mm -hmm. And many times it came with a lot of bit of spice. Yeah, you get popped a couple of times. Uh, yeah, a lot of times. A lot of times. A lot you of times. A, a lot of, a lot of times. Know? And I, I remember once... Um... <laughs> <laughs> laughing. I'm laughing because I just remember I needed to get in shape. And my mom was like, you're out of shape. So she, like, almost like Rocky, she kicked me out the car, drove the car, said, you're going to run behind the car. <laughs> and then drove up the hill while I'm running behind the car. And then, you know, this being a basketball movie and, and, and me having been a basketball player, I started dunking when I was in the eighth grade. And there was one time I, I couldn't dunk and my mom had taken me to the park and she said, you're going to dunk until we leave this park. Ooh. Yeah. And I said, mom, but I can't dunk. She's like, can't is not an option. Ooh. So she, we stayed there. We got there probably six o'clock. Stayed, for, stayed there for three hours until I got my first dunk. And then she was like, now you got to get another one so I know that it's not fake. <gasps> so then I had to do another one. So she was very, very uh, motivating to me. Uh, Mama did what? Shout out to Cassandra. Shout out to my grandmother, Josephine. They both, um, 
They both pulled no punches. All right. And All look how intended. you turned out. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you so much for coming on. I appreciate yes. you having me. And you can watch White Men Can't Jump. It begins streaming on Hulu on May 19th. And that is what you need to know for this Monday. Come on back tomorrow. I'm Eva Pilgrim. I'm DeMarco Morgan. And I'm Dr. Jen Ashton. Yeah, from all of us here at ABC News, along with Cinco Walls, have a wonderful day, and we'll see you tomorrow. GMA fans, Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.